Well, we're still about a month away from Christmas, but the holiday spirit coming a little early for a Rock Hill man. His broken heating and AC unit making it tough for him to be comfortable at home. But this community hero is getting some much needed relief thanks to a generous donation from Brothers Heating, Cooling and Plumbing. We'll do the uh, dark gray one. If there's a problem. A friend of mine, she needs an alternator and a power steering pump. Bring it to Lonnie Sims and he'll fix it. Labor intensive is all it is. Uh, when somebody's car is busted, uh, when they've gone to the repair shop and gotten a estimate of something that they can't afford. The power steering pump she needs to have replaced. For he credits his generosity and handy skills right now, to God and his degree in automotive science. But over the past several years, Lonnie, who served 14 years in the Army, has had to deal with his own problem. When you have it, you take it for granted. No one gives a second thought to it. His central air conditioner stopped working and a home his father bought. I had to revert back to stuff my grandmother and grandfather taught me. Went and bought a couple of kerosene heaters. Lonnie has tried fixing it and even considered buying a new one. It's easy when, when you got it, but uh, this is one of those cases when an old man didn't have it. Recently, Rick Starnes with Brothers Heating, Cooling and Plumbing stopped by for a visit. It's all the need that he had, his circumstances. I thought he had come to talk to me about one of the estimates that I had got to buy a unit. Little did Lonnie know, his name was submitted in the Brothers and ARS Cares Community Heroes program in which a new heating and cooling system is installed to a deserving community hey. hero. And not long after Rick's visit, Lonnie found out he won. It's Christmas. It's Christmas for an old man. It's bigger, it's beautiful, it works. He gives a helping hand so much. Now it's great, and me being a Navy veteran also, it's great that we can give a helping hand to him. Don't give up hope if you got a will. There's always a way. And for 